Hi and welcome back to Yachty. Today we're taking a look at a Catalina 350 called Evening Breeze. We took Evening Breeze out for sale on Pitwater. This yacht normally lives in a private pen on Sydney Harbour. Today she was up for, a, up for the summer break on Pitwater and we took her out for a sale. And what we found was, of course, a very comfortable, very well put together cruising yacht, but also something that was really, really well specified. So some major inclusions or, or additions that were chosen when this boat was, was originally ordered in 2007 was the hard dodger you can see there, so the hard top dodger with the soft clear wrap around, so really nice all weather protection. Also the leisure furl boom, in, in boom mainsail furling system. So really easy, easy way to, to, to hoist the mainsail. What we'll also see on the foredeck is, is a self tacking jib track. So today we see the Genoa being used, but there's also a self tacking jib which makes for really easy short handed sailing. Another major addition was the electric halyard winch which is, which is on the coach roof to starboard, just making the hoisting that much easier. Here we see the centre piece or the, or the helm seat lifts out to give that really nice access into the water or onto the dock, very large swim platform, full cockpit cushions included. In cl including for the princess seats and a good a good selection of raymarine instruments are used so a colour colour chart plotter at the helm there easily reached by the helm so that that image there just showed the really nice visibility we see looking looking forward through the through the hard dodger under the hard dodger Here we see that stainless steel self-tacking jib track on the foredeck there. Down below, we jump inside an awesome, very comfortable, very well-built Catalina. So really nice features. This is the owner's or forward cabin forward head and shower. So, th so this space can be accessed either via the main saloon or there is also a private door coming in off the, off the forward cabin. So there was a full stand up shower there with separate screen. And this is a nice, nice addition here. So this, the, the seating to starboard can either be converted into a, essentially a bench or a couch or, or, or utilized as a, as a coffee table set up. Navigation station and switchboard to port 35 horsepower diesel, logging around 400 hours. Big aft cabin, so it actually would be, it's a challenge to, 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 to pick the major or the, the bigger cabin on board this yacht. So two really nice size double cabins. The mainsail, as you can see, is fully battened. And so her sail inventory includes the fully buttoned mainsail, the Genoa we see today, a spare Genoa, a self-tacking headsail, and also an asymmetric kite. So as mentioned, Evening Breeze normally lives on her private pen on Sydney Harbour, so available for inspection on Sydney Harbour. She presents really well, it's a late model, very comfortable, well-built cruising, cruising yacht. So do give us a call on the number coming up on your screen. We'd love to offer you some more information and show you on board. Thanks for watching.